Hello, my friends. It's Nancy Bastien. Oh, that light's going to glare. We won't have that on today. I'm coming on today because I want to do some gluing in my chunky monkey. Remember, I found this. I found this book. I finally found it again. And we have a few pages done, but we need to do more in here because... He not very chunky, see. I have neglected poor little chunky monkey. But first of all, I want to show you some things that I've been doing. I'm so proud of them because I have never, I have been trying and trying and trying and trying my hardest. And in, up until now, I have never been able to color faces and make them look like a face. And I have done two now from a coloring book and I am so proud of them that I wanna show you. And this is the first one I did. Isn't she gorgeous? I kinda of made her ear a little too dark cause I forgot her ear and I couldn't remember what I did on her face. But I love her. Isn't she just gorgeous? And on this one, the shading was already on there from the coloring book. But I got it right. She looks beautiful. To me, she looks beautiful. I hope she does to you. And the second one is not finished yet, but I love it it's so far. The farther... the. The farthest I've gotten done on this, I have loved. And so I want to show you. Look at her. Isn't she gorgeous? I just have this background to do. This butterfly and all this stuff to do. But I am so proud that I, I got it. I finally got it. And I looked at Claire... Claire's coloring. I, I watched her. I watched another one on YouTube that uses paint. It's not Kelly. It's somebody else. She uses paint. Uh, she uses flesh color. And she, she kind of got my mind thinking that you, when you put a, you got to layer and layer and layer. And that's what I did on this one. I layered and layered later. I put a light on, and then I put a darker color on, and then I put the light on. And that's what she said you have to do, is when you put a dark color on, you have to go over it with the light color so that it doesn't look so stark and dark. And that's what I did on this one. And she had no shading. I did all the shading myself. And I'm loving her. I think she looks gorgeous. And when I get her all finished, I'm going to make a book. Now, these are out of coloring books, and I took the originals out and copied them on um, cardstock. And I'm going to make a book of, uh, I'm going to put them in a, a sleeve and a loose leaf three ring binder book and put them all in there. I write my name on them. I wrote my name on the back of this one. And the date that I colored it. And I'm just so proud. I finally learned. I'm so proud of it. I'm going to post them on Facebook. So, here we go. Now, we're going to glue. We're going to glue. And I've got a whole thing of stuff, stuff, stuff. To glue yeah I've even got um, what is this called what kind of paper is this called oh I can't remember what this paper is called oh the girl from Hawaii she uses it a lot she calls it it starts with a J that's all I know so anyway, let's get started. And I have my my Harbor Freight catalog over here to glue in. Yeah. 
And so we are going to get started on a page in here. You know what? We haven't done the first page. Let's get the first page done. And the inside of my books are not done either. I need to get the inside of my covers done. But I'm going to turn this back so that this will be flatter, maybe. And we're going to glue a... Um, I want to put a like a background paper on this like like so like that before we glue anything on and I'm not sure which I think this is I'm gonna tear this is deli paper so I'm gonna tear this top off this white space Yeah, right, right, sure I am. I don't even know how to tear paper. Oh, yes I do. Okay, we can sit here and watch me tear paper all day. I think I'm going to need this light on. What do you guys think? For me to see, I think I'm going to need this light on. I know it's going to glare. I try to get over it, guys. Okay, let's use some... Uh, let's set this aside over here. Uh, for a minute. And I'm going to... Ooh, that side's pretty, too. That side's prettier. I'm gonna tear this off and put it down here. Yeah, that'll work. That will work. So, let's glue. Oh, that's the wrong end. This is the end. I don't know when this is going to run out, but when it does run out, I'm going to get the smaller kinds. I have to go to a special art store to pick these up. This Yuhu glue. My craft stores around here don't seem to want to carry it. So, let's hope it glues this page on. So hi, um, let's just tear it, okay? So how y'all been? I know I have been absent for a couple of weeks, but oh, I glued that on the wrong side. Oh well, it's on there now. Darn it. Why didn't you, did you guys yell at me? That I had it on the wrong side. Oh well. So be it. It's on it's on the page now. It's on there now. So we'll try to get this on the right side. I have been packing my house. I know you guys are probably thinking, why is she packing so soon? Well, I live in a house, a two-bedroom house by myself with a whole lot of junk. A whole lot of stuff. The stuff that was Wes's that I haven't gone through yet. I still have three sets of drums to sell. If anybody's interested in a set of drums, let me know. I'll leave my email at the bottom of the page. You can PayPal me. I'm not shipping, though. You'll have to pay for shipping. And I'm sure there'll be a lot to ship because there are big drums. Oops, sorry. I was just going to get some. Uh, 
ink here to kind of go along the bottom here of this page and my cutter dropped on the floor so I'm sorry there 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 so we got that on the page now we gotta find something to glue on here yep to glue on this page so let me look here I'm thinking Josh Josh Jock Jock paper Jock paper that's what this is and I have some American paper too that is $500 bills let's put that in there put that on there and let's put some of this jock paper on here let's put one there and let's see if I got other kinds I got all kinds of jock paper I'm sure that's what she called it was jock paper look at this one Aha! We're going to put that on a page. Let's see about this one. We're going to have a money page. A money page. Yes, we are. We're going to have a money page. With this paper on it. Okay. Let's put that on there. It's even pretty on the opposite side. See? I could, I could probably put it in as a, a flip. Um, I got so much of it that I could probably do that eventually, but not right now. I just want to get something down in this book. That looks good. If it'll just stick, 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 stick. Is this Queen Elizabeth? Is that who that is? That Queen Elizabeth? And that's some... Um, somebody in China? Yeah. So yeah, I've been packing... I've been packing a, a bit of my crafts. Some that I'm not using right now, like... Paints that I'm not using. Um... Yeah, um, got those packed. All my diamond paintings that I was doing, that I, I quit doing because I got tired of it. I packed all that away. You guys, I went and bought plastic bins. At, and they're deep. And they're nice. Um, I they were five dollars a piece at um, Big Lots, and so I bought. First of all, I went and bought ten of them. Uh, oh, ten! Ten will be quite a quite a few. I'm gonna I'm gonna tear a piece and see if I can put another piece in here, because you know I have a jillion of these. And you see, I have that one. Uh, just tear it. See if I can put it on the bottom. I should have tore. Anyway, I should have, should have. I didn't, so we'll save that piece. That piece will go right there. So I bought these bins and. My son, he mentioned to me, he said, Mom, see if you can go to Costco and buy those bins. Um, and he had great big ones that had the fold, plastic fold in. Oh, I can put some there, too. A plastic fold in. Um, they, um, The lids folded in. And, but I don't have a Costco card. 
So he said, well, let me try to see if I can find them online. And I'll give you my card number and you can buy them online. But he could not find them online. So I told him, I said, I'm going to go to Big Lots and see what they have. Because usually they have pretty good stuff pretty good supply of them so i was shocked when i saw they were five dollars okay we got that page done in a hurry and um they were you know i was shocked and i said are you sure to the lady and she took one and went and scanned it she said yeah they're five dollars so i brought okay let's go to a different page so i brought it Brought them home and um, started filling them up. That's pretty. And um, I'm just loving them because I can stack them. And um, they'll be easy for my, my kids to... Um, to put on the, the truck and uh, so when I went back and bought some more, about 15 more of them and the girl says, oh, we're going to have plenty of those because we got another truck coming in. So if you need more, come and get them. So. Well, come payday, I was going to go get some more, except for, um, I'm going to have to wait till the end of the month now, because, well, it's actually the middle of the month when I get my Social Security check, because I had to spend $221 for prescriptions the other day after I went to the doctor. Because she said all my prescriptions needed to be filled. And so, yeah. Some were for 90 days. So, yeah, I understood why they cost so much money. But still, I have insurance. They shouldn't cost that much money. There's one pill that I take um, that costs... And it's the um, Liness. Liness. I'm sure you've all seen it advertised on TV. It's for if you have um, too much information. If you have constipation. If you're contemplating <laughs> with that constipation. Oh, I'm sorry. Too much information. On the toilet. Which I do. Because I take pills that make me that way. Then she prescribed me these new pills. And they are expensive. They're $400 a prescription. Can you believe it? And my insurance only paid almost all of it. I had to pay like $20 or something like that. Which is cool because I didn't have to pay $400 for them. I think that's just outrageous. I think our government is outrageous on the price of pharmaceuticals. Just because they're a new a new thing. Now my sister-in-law, she's taken that new medicine for uh, bipolar. It's a shot that she gets once a month. And it is costing her, well, it's not costing her, her insurance pays for it, but it's $2,000 per shot. Is that ridiculous? Because it's brand new medicine they're trying on her. They're new, it's new medicine. And it's working very well for her bipolar. But $2,000 so she got in the catastrophic phase of her insurance. 
So now until December, which is only a month away, for the month of December, she doesn't have to pay anything for her for her prescriptions, and she takes a boatload, kind of like me. We take a boatload. When you get old, the doctors start just prescribing you boatloads of medicine because they can. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway. So, my $5 bins have got to wait, but that's okay because I still have a few of them that I can pack. And so, my house, I just move stuff around, move, move furniture around and stack them up by the wall, and isn't that pretty? That's pretty. I have to trim that after it's dry. But, yeah, I just have them stacked up and... Of course, they're not boxes. They are, um, my page is sticking to this. Um, they are bins, and so they don't look too bad. All right, I'm going to get into my little stuff here. I'm going to move some of this big stuff out of here. And get into my little pieces that I want to use. I have cut out that I want to put on the pages. Look at those girls in their bathing suit. That's kind of pretty. Let's see what else we can find to go with them. I have all these little pieces cut, but I have some that are already. I even have some flyers from Trader Joe's that I'm going to use. I have things cut out like this. Yeah, no. I'm trying to get to those. I sat and fussy cut them out. I think I should use them. I'm trying to find something that will go nice on the bottom of that page. That maybe like a sunset or something like that in my bin here. Let's see what I can find. I got all kinds of stuff. Let's see. Um, I put rice roni on there. And maybe, I don't know. What about these oranges? Let's see about these oranges on here. Yeah, that looks kind of cool. We'll tear that one off. We'll put it down here. That looks cool with the girls on the beach eating oranges instead of rice a roni the San Francisco treat okay we're gonna use the um, I'm gonna go over here and paint it with some glue so yeah that's what I have been doing um, I really need to go through the extra bedroom um, that was Wes's computer room and his, he's got a set of drums up there. His mother bought him a double bed. Well, she didn't buy him a double bed. She bought him a mattress and a box of springs to go on the double bed that we brought from her house so we'd have an extra bed. And a chest of drawers, and I need to go through all the drawers and get his stuff out of the drawers. Oh, I have so much to do, and I, I'm feeling like I'm suffocating in so little time to do it in. Because I basically have to do this by myself. I have no companion to, to help me. I'm going to put it, put it like that. Let's 
Yeah, I have no... I have no person to help me, so... I have to do it by myself, and that's, that is really scary. To know that you have to do all this packing by yourself, without any help. But, a lot of stuff I'm not taking. I'm giving to thrift stores. Oh, look. My glue is almost gone. Oh. I'm not going to be able to use the rest of that today. I'm going to have to get out the other glue sticks. Lord only knows I've got a million of them. I'll have to get out these sticks. See how these work in my climate here. I did that to get the there's a little crusty stuff on the top of this. So anyhow, that's my story. And so I've had very little time to do any videos because I've been coloring in my off time, learning how to color. Oh, I am so proud of myself. I don't know if I should pat myself on my back or not, but I am really proud of myself to learn how to do that and make them look like real people and not just like a coloring out of a coloring book. And, uh, yeah. All right, we got to find something else to go on this page. Something else. Let's see. I gotta find something little. I got little things. That says want it. Want it? Should I put want it right there? I want that orange. Alright, we'll put that on there. And um, luckily, I haven't been buying too many foods because I don't eat. And I had a lot of canned foods that, um, for Wes, that I'm going to give the, um, I'll never eat them. So I'm going to give them to the food drive when the kids come around for the scouts. At Thanksgiving time, yeah, I'm going to have a, I'm going to get them out now and get them out in a bag so I can just hand them a bag and, uh-huh, that's what I'm going to do. Alright, I don't have anything right now to go in that little corner that I, that I can see that I want to go in that little corner. So... We are going to go over to another page. I think that's cute, though. I need something to go in this little corner right here. Anyway, let's go over to another page. All right, let's put a background on this one. Let's see what we should use for a background here. We've used our Jaws paper. So, oops, I could put, I could put a piece of this on there. Let's see about Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's these anymore. It's because I haven't been shopping there. I need to go back and shop there and tell them I want their um, their paper again. Oh my gosh.
I didn't want to, I didn't want to tear that because it says turkey and cranberry dog treats. Bean screen. And I think this is really cute and I don't want to tear too much of it off. Hmm. Mm, 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 mm. I like this picture. I like this picture. I like this print. And I like this. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? This is a fearless flyer. I know I probably don't need to tear all this off, but it's, you know, it's, it's just stuff. I need to figure out how to, I'm gonna fold that over. I want, I want that to be on my, oh, you know what I need to be using is my, my, hang on, my terror thingies ruler. I have some terror ruler to tear my pages. Yeah, this is, needs to be. Okay, let's see how we can get this on here. Okay, that fits across there now. Oh, it's getting so close to Thanksgiving. I think Thanksgiving and then Christmas. And then there's Valentine's. And then there is... I don't know when Easter is, but then there is April when I move out. And to me, to you, that might seem like a, quite a ways away, but to me, that's really close. <laughs> when you have so much to do, I have, um, I need to take pictures of his uh, music components that I need to sell and somebody told me to sell them on YouTube and so I need to take pictures of them to put on YouTube she's gonna help me do that and um, let's see where's my terror here why am I not using my my nice little terror that is cool Let's use it over here and get this white space off. Oh, I like it. I like it. And let's get this print off of here. People said if you tear it with a big piece, it's easier, which it is, to pick up instead of trying to pick up this little piece. And I'm going to kind of tear this on an angle here. Trader Joe's pumpkin pie. And I want to tear this white space off. This is not this year's um, paper, so. Um, don't look at this date up there and think you have to get your turkey by December 10th or November 10th because. This paper is from, I don't see a, a date on it. Anyway, I want to put this little guy here and this woman here. I could tear that turkey November 10th off of there.
Trader Joe's has the best brine turkeys. Ugh, if you want a brine turkey, Trader Joe's has the best. They really do have the best. Okay, I'm going to put that there. Put that there. And put this here. This little cornucopia. And put that down there. Put that little cornucopia right over here. I need to tear this straight edge off of that. Mm -mm. I need to go and turn my chicken soup down. Hang on. I'll be right back. I bought a roast, uh, roast, roast, what is it, rotisserie chicken the other day at IGA. I was hungry for chicken. I wanted chicken so bad. I was hungered for it. And mm, my, the fried chicken, I was just going to get a few pieces of the fried chicken. And they didn't have any, they only had a few, they didn't have any drumsticks. They only had a few thighs. They didn't have very many. Um, here's a word that says, let's get started. We can put that on there. And they only had breasts, and I don't eat breasts. I don't eat fried chicken breasts. I don't. They're so dry. I can't stand them on my roof of my mouth, and so I don't eat them. So I. That's all they had. So they just had taken these chickens off the rotisserie, and so I got me one of those. Well, I get a home. And I don't have my little Wes here to help me eat that chicken. Let's see what this says. Turkey's November. This says pumpkin pie. I can put that right down there. Put that right there. Put that right there. Put that right there. Yeah. And put this right here. Somewhere. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. So, I only ate just a teeny tiny, I ate one thigh off of this chicken. And I wasn't going to let it go to waste in my, and it's so cold here. I wasn't just going to let it go to waste. So, I got it out of my fridge today. And I got, I bought stuff. Because I knew I wasn't going to eat much of that chicken. And I had bought carrots and onions and stuff to make soup with it. Because I knew eventually I was going to make some soup. Well, that eventually came today. So I am boiling the soup, the chicken and an onion and some spices. I'm letting it, I brought it to a boil, and that's what was boiling, and so I just went in there and turned it down to simmer, and I'm going to let it simmer, and unfortunately, I packed my Instant Pot, um, so I just, I wanted a, I, I bought a pot, oops, last year, that stuck to my finger. You see that? That stuck to my finger. Are we even in frame so you guys can see what I'm doing? I'll be mad if I've been out of frame all this time, not paying attention. So anyway, I um, knew I was going to make soup with this chicken. Eventually, I knew I was going to. 
So I bought the stuff to go in the soup. And sure enough, I, but, oh, I was telling you, I bought a, I bought a galvanized stock pot last year before I bought my instant pot. And, um, I got it out of the box and was, uh, tore the sticker off of the front of it. And then was reading about it, and it says you can't use it on a flat top stove. Yeah, can you believe it? I can't use it on my flat top stove. So, I had to use my other pot, and I called... I called my sister-in-law to see if she had a stock pot that had a um, I don't know why I tore that off anyway a stock pot that had a strainer in it so I could just make like a stock with this chicken and just pick it up out and not have to worry about pouring all the juice to strain it, to strain the onion and the bones and all that good stuff out of it. So, I had to use my other pot because I am not going out to buy a new one when I'm moving. And, anyway. Long story, I put it in a pot that I'm going to have to strain and burn myself. I'll let it cool down some before I strain it. And make soup. I'm going to cut up carrots and celery. I'm already boiling it with the onions, so I don't need to have any onions in there. And... Um, I don't have to have any pieces of onions because I don't like onions but I like the flavor of them and carrots and celery and all that good stuff and then was that my word where did my words go where did my word go where did my words go anybody see where my words went I probably stuck them on something under here. Oh, crud. Oh, well. That's not my word. Oh, well. I can't find my words that I wanted to put right here. Oh, here it is. Let's get started. Right there. Let's get started on this page. And I still need something else on the bottom here. Um, so I'm making soup today. And I'm making homemade noodles. Yes, I'm making homemade egg noodles. Should I put that there? That's all words. Print. Newsprint. Let's find something I can put. Oh, I can put this across there. I'll cut it out first and then decide what I'm going to trim off of it. Because I know it's too big. Anywho, I love homemade noodles. So, I'm going to make homemade noodles and use up my eggs because <laughs> I don't need eggs either. Well, you know what? I did eat a couple of eggs the other night in, in, um,
what do I want to say in tribute to my late husband I ate some eggs I ate some eggs for him I did and they were pretty good if you put enough ketchup on them they're pretty good but if you don't put ketchup on them they're not so good yeah oh man I cut it off too short Ugh. Oh my, 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 I'm having difficulties with this page. Am I in frame so that you can see my difficulties with this page? Yeah, you like my singing? No. And also, guess what? Um, I have clothes. When I had my stomach surgery, before I got on YouTube, I had a hiatal hernia fixed. And in fixing my hiatal hernia, it made my stomach, they made my stomach, it was almost like a gastro bypass but they didn't do a bypass but they made my stomach the size of a almond all right we got that page that's all i'm going to put on that page unless i find something cuter let's go to another page here and so i lost a ton of weight First of all, I was losing weight because I couldn't keep anything down. And this is kind of cute. Color right there on that. I don't know if I'm going to use it on that. But I'm going to tear it. I'm going to tear it up. I'm going to tear this white space off of it if I can. And so I got down into a size six clothes. And because I couldn't eat, I just could not eat. And what I ate hurt my stomach really bad. All right, I'm going to turn the page because I need a clean page here to glue on and I've got gradually I started putting on weight and getting into some um, bigger clothes and unfortunately I have all those I didn't get rid of them thinking oh I'm gonna get back down I'm gonna get back I'm gonna lose this weight I'm gonna I'm never going to get back up there where I was. Uh, I don't say never. Because all of a sudden, when my kidneys started going into failure, which I'll tell you about in a minute, I started bloating up and gaining weight and having to buy bigger clothes. So all my, ah, oh, this glue is not working, it's not working. So I have all of those clothes that I need to go through and give to the thrift store. I'm going to give them to the veterans. Plus I have all Wes's clothes to give to the veterans. Uh-huh. Now, let's see. What can we put on here on the bottom of that color? Let's see here. Should we put, should we put Geico on here? 
Should we put the little Geico frog on here? I think we should put the little Geico frog on here. But we need to put something down here first. So he'll have something to sit on. How about a map? Connecting is what U.S. is all about. Let us hear from you. I think that's kind of a cute thing. So we will... We will... We will try to tear that and put it down there on the bottom. And, yeah. So I got to go through all those clothes. Uh -huh. You know, I just... Oops. I just get overwhelmed at everything I, I need to do. It really is overwhelming me a lot. And I think I need to tear this, but it's too small to tear on that edge of that ruler. You know, I look at stuff and I go, oh my gosh. I just need to sit my little hiney down on the floor Put those clothes in a pile. Sit my little hiney down and say, okay, this goes in this bag to the thrift store. And get it in the bag. And call the veterans people. I think I have to put it in a special bag for them. I need to call them and ask them. And then they can get the... The chester drawers and the dresser and the bed frame out of here. And, yeah, that's just what I need to do. But, I, I get, oh, I, I say that and then I just get overwhelmed when I look at it. And I think, oh... I just can't do that today. So I'm going to go glue in my glue book and complain to my viewers <laughs> what I can't do. What I can do and what I can't do. Okay, Geico person, let's put you right there. Oh, you look so cute right there. You do. You look really cute right there, little Geico guy. Need to put you up so we can connecting is what U.S. is all about. Let us hear from you. So you need to get Geico insurance when you're going to go on a trip. No, you don't need to get Geico insurance. You can get any insurance you want. All right, let's glue on here. Now he's pretty hefty, hefty paper, so... I don't know. Maybe I should have used wet glue. I don't want to use wet glue. I want to use dry glue. And I want to get it on there before it dries. So Mr. Geico can go on here like this. And it's already dried. And it's not sticking. Oh, why me? Why me? Um, I've connected on uh, Messenger and on um, oh, email with a old, 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 well, she's not that old, but we were little when we were friends, and we've reconnected, and it, it's just, I have just been so, it's just been wonderful to talk to her and reminisce about old times and what we did and how we got into trouble, and yeah, 
it's just been really fun. Really, really fun. All right, should we put something up here? What should we put up there? Should we put, um, I got some cute stuff in here. Um, let's see. I got a lot of flowers because I had flowers and blooms. Magazine. Birds and blooms. Oh, you know what I need to get rid of? I need to get rid of some of these stickers. I'm going to use those. Um, I have been on here for 55 minutes and haven't done a thing. How about if we put this little sleeping cat right there? And... Something else, maybe? Mm. How about a little doggy? We don't want to cover up too much of the um, color and also the Geico guy. We don't want to cover him up. So I'm just going to cut tear along this little doggy. We gotta have a cat and a dog together, right? We can't be prejudiced. However, I'm kind of a little bit prejudiced. I do like dogs better than I do cats because I am allergic to cats. Oh, we can put him right there, and we can put that little, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to put the doggy and the kitty cat and the frog on this page. Yes, we are. We're going to put him up here so he doesn't cover up the color the word color because the gecko head did that for us and then we're gonna put this little kitty this little kitty ornament I think it's a door stopper a little kitty door stopper a sleeping kitty with wings as a door stopper that's kind of creepy a kitty with wings? Isn't that... Oh, I want to move it over a little bit. Isn't that kind of creepy? I think it is. I think it's a little creepy. It's a gothic. It's gothic. It's a gothic kitty. Yeah. Okay. Let's do one more page. And then we'll probably call it quits. Because... I will be on here for an hour and haven't done a thing. Let's do something on here. We've got to get a background on here. Let's put this page on here as a background. Now, I don't know if this is going glue down or not because this is plastic paper. And I think this is plastic paper. And I don't know what else I can use as a background. Background paper. These are jelly papers. I can put that one on there. Yeah, let's put that one on there. Let's make sure we're on the front page. Okay, this is the back. And I'm just going to put glue all over this. And hopefully I can get it on here fast enough to put that page down. Um, so yeah, we've been go we've been reminiscing about old stories and about this lady who played the organ at our church and one 
one Saturday she it was in the afternoon and she was practicing and we were playing and we decided because I lived right behind the church and she was at my house and we decided we would go over and I don't know what made us do it but we went over there and decided to kick the door while she was practicing her organ which made her very upset I'm just going to take this and glue it over onto the next page and she came and she grabbed us and in that old church that we had our bathrooms were by the front door I mean we lived in an old funky town with old funky buildings nothing like and it's still standing and anyway she grabbed us and the boys restroom was on one side and the girls bathroom was on the other side and she grabbed us and she locked us in that bathroom somehow she got the door locked from the outside and locked us in and she proceeded to go back and play her organ and we were scared to death thinking that we were never going to get out of there so yeah, we opened the window and squoze our little bodies through the window and proceeded to jump out the window now it wasn't it wasn't high enough to kill us but you know and so we jumped out the window and I remember she went home sh and I she ran home she lived uh, quite a ways away from me not quite a ways away a little ways away from me and I ran home and I remember my dad sitting in the chair and he said come here sis and he wanted me to get up on his lap and I he always would put me on his lap and rock me. And I think I was about seven or eight years old. I wasn't very old. And um, I'm looking for stuff to go on this page. How about some Norman Rockwell? Mm, yeah. And how about Oh, it's not going to fit on there. I want it to fit on there. That, um, and, uh, anyway, so I got up on his lap, and I was shaking. I was just shaking. And he said, what's wrong? What's wrong, sis? And I said, oh, nothing, nothing. I was so scared. I was so scared she was going to come and tell my parents what I had done and that I was going to be in big trouble. And she didn't come and tell my parents, but I was, I was a shaking and a rocking and a rolling and I was scared to death. And we talked about that on the email. I'm going to put ruby red slippers on here from Alice in Wonderland book that I copied and then I'm going to put these little girls on here I think and I just keep looking through here seeing what I can put on here and it's probably just taking up all my time oh look I cut out these the other day little bird houses out of a magazine I think that'll be cute on there. Let's see. Let's take these off. Let's put that on there. Let's take her off. Let's put these on here, and then maybe I'll find some little birds. A little bird? A bird. I know I have birds in here. I know I cut out birds. Yeah, where they are, I don't know. So anyway, yeah, we've been talking about stuff like that and how, yeah, we got into trouble and yeah, we were friends for a long time. And then, I don't know, we had a rivalry 
it was a rivalry, girls, and three of us could not get along together. So it was either her or me, or her and this other girl, or me and this other girl. We always left one out, which was so stupid. Okay, where are my bird pictures? I need to have these more organized, I swear. I'm going to organize these. I'm going to put cats, birds, and people, and so I don't have to do this every time I come to collage in my book. I know there's a bird in here somewhere. There's another. That's not a bird. Oh, come on. Bird, show up. So anyway, yeah. Um, I don't know if y'all have had that kind of, but it's been really fun talking with her and reminiscing. Um, yeah, those old times that we used to have. And um, I'm going to have to edit a lot of this out, I think. I don't no, I can't find any birds. Here's some birds. Oh, look, these are stickers. You know when you get, um, I get these address labels from different places. Um, I got some stickers of birds. Let's get these glued down and then we'll put those stickers on. That'll make a good page, and then we can end this video, and I can shut up. I can stop talking. Yeah. Any, I, I usually never have anything to say, and then I'm really concentrating. But this is so relaxing, glowing, gluing, glowing, gluing things down that um, it makes me want to jibber jabber. Jibber jabber, yeah. Chit chat about nothing. Anyway, she sent me, and I mistakenly deleted it. But she sent. She was in our our town. She said the other day, and she went by the church, and she took a picture of it, and she uh, messaged me that picture on my phone, and. I couldn't figure out what it was and I I didn't know who it was from and I think I got some nasty um, were uh, nasty things about a prostitute house or something like that so I just deleted it not know she would never say that so I don't know why that was on there or maybe it was just my imagination I don't know but anyhow I, I clicked the delete button and then I got an email from her yesterday saying that she sent me a picture of the old church to see how far we had to jump from that window because she had a hard time remembering that but it was her it was her and I who did that and her mom played the organ also and played the piano and Man, I don't know what got into us to go over there and be so mischievous and be so mean. Yeah. To that lady. But we were. We got in a mood. I guess we were bored and didn't know what else to do. And we heard her playing, so we thought we'd go chime in with kicking on the door. And um, that didn't go over too well. No, it didn't go over too well. So, yeah, we got in trouble. Well, we didn't. We didn't get in trouble at home because my parents, my parents never knew that story. I did never tell them. And I guess that lady, if she told my mom and told my mom that she locked us in the bathroom, that would have been not nice for for her to tell my mom that because my mom would have come unglued on her for locking her little girl in a bathroom to punish her for it would have been better punishment if she would have just sent us home and said that she was going to tell our parents what we did 
she come out there, I think, twice and asked us to stop. And we just laughed at her and started doing it again. So she was really angry. As soon as she'd start playing, we would start doing that. Okay, I'm going to put these little stickers on here. Yay! I only got two of the birds. That's enough. That is plenty. All right, I got bird houses and birds. And if I find anything else in the meantime that will fit on here, I shall glue it on. All right, guys, I'm going to get off of here. And I hope you enjoyed this. If you all like this video, please, please, please um, do a thumbs up. And please leave comments, even if you're just on there to say hi. Say hi to me. You don't leave me a comment. I think nobody's watching and nobody cares. But I see the views on there, but I don't see any comments. I like comments. Could you please leave me a comment? And subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel. And you want to see more of these. Please subscribe and then put... Uh, ring the little bell by the side of the subscription notice at the bottom and I'm gathering up all these little papers to throw them away and you will get a notice of of uh, when I'm going to be on next time and I will have things for us to do maybe so I'm just going to stick this little paper on here because it's just sitting here and it's kind of pretty so I'm just going to glue it on there just because I don't want to throw it away. So I'm just going to put it on here. Just like that. No reason. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I will see you on the next video. Bye bye.